Hi everyone, this is Space Toad, and today I'm going to start a series of tutorials on Star Spores, or at least uh, the part of Star Spore that are currently available online from the uh, Star Spore website. So let's get started. This is the website as it should appear to you, and the first thing I'm going to do is to open the ship library and see uh, what other people have made. This is actually something that you can access to even if you're not plugged in or registered already. Um, so I will put a link at the end of the video uh, directly linking to the ship I'm, I'm showing right now. So to access to this library, I'm clicking on library here and then I can see that there are 10 ships uh, that have been designed so far. Uh, obviously as this number increases there will be ways to browse through uh, the ship library according to various um, criteria. But for now, let's look at this um, this big green ship in the middle here. If I click on it, I'm opening the ship viewer and uh, loading the ship in the environment. Let me adjust the view here. Okay, so the way it works so far is that the ship viewer has a tendency of putting you inside the ship. But you have the, the mouse wheel that can help you to go further away or closer to the ship center. So if I click in the view so that uh, the environment knows that uh, I want to interact with the viewer and then use the mouse wheel, as you can see, I can move further away and now I have you on the ship from uh, from some overview. If I click and if I hold the right button of the mouse and then drag the mouse around, I'm rotating around uh, around the ship. As a matter of fact, I'm rotating around the first element of the ship which happens to be this uh, big piece of hull here. If I left click on other elements, here uh, there are two others, the, the left and right engines, I will center the view around that element. This is the first mode to navigate around the ship. Uh, at any point you can go back to this mode by hitting the C button here. The other buttons are other ways to navigate. And the first one is X. X will provide means to have some kind of free navigation in the ship. So now that I've clicked on X, if I right click and hold the, the button of the mouse and then drag around, as you can see what I'm changing here is uh, my point of view or the direction of my point of view. I'm not rotating around the ship anymore. Using the mouse wheel or the arrows, I'm going to be able to move uh, relative to my current position, uh, which gives some way of um, navigating freely within the ship. Now, the five less uh, the, the five last buttons are shortcuts to place the free navigation onto certain uh, positions. So the front will put me on front of the ship and again uh, if I use the row I can navigate, if I use the right click hold I can change the direction where I'm looking at. So F is for front, B is for back, I'm looking at the back of the ship now, L is for left, R gives me the view on the right part, and then I have this one for top and this one for bottom. That's about it for this short introduction of the uh, Blueprint Viewer. Those buttons on the top right corner, they are going to be here for the um, Blueprint Builder as well, so it's useful to uh, know about them and I will see you right back for the next video where I'm going to start introducing how to create your own spaceship.